The anticipation for One UI 9.0 is reaching its peak, and it makes sense because Samsung users are always eager for big software upgrades. The upcoming update is shaping up to be a major step forward with new features, deeper customization, smarter AI integration, and a more refined interface. Even though Samsung has not revealed an official device list, leaks reports, and Samsung's current update policy provide a strong idea of what to expect, Samsung now promises up to four major OS upgrades for select flagship and mid-range devices, which gives a clear roadmap for how far One UI 9.0 will go. One UI 9.0 is expected to be based on Android 17, marking a big leap in performance security and system optimizations. A late 2026 release seems likely, although beta testing could begin months earlier. Similar to previous years, the newest flagship smartphones will either come pre, installed with the update, or be the first to receive it. The Galaxy S26 lineup is expected to ship with One UI 9.0 right out of the box, showing the full potential of Samsung's next-generation software. After that, the Galaxy S25 series should be first in line, followed by the Galaxy S24 and S23 series. Even the Galaxy S22 lineup is expected to qualify thanks to Samsung's four-year upgrade promise. This approach keeps a wide range of older flagship users included in another major update cycle. Samsung's foldable lineup will also receive priority treatment. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 should come pre-installed with the update. A fast rollout is likely for the Fold 6 and Flip 6, followed by the Fold 5, Flip 5, and even the Fold 4 and Flip 4. Foldable phones are costly investments, so keeping them updated helps retain value and user satisfaction over time. Mid-range devices are not being left behind either. The Galaxy A series is expected to be well covered, especially popular models like the Galaxy A7X lineup, A56, A55, and A54. Devices such as the A36, A35, and A34 are also likely to qualify, along with upcoming models like the A26 and A16 if they launch before the One UI 9.0 rollout. Samsung's strategy to extend support to mid-range devices has boosted their popularity worldwide and helped create a loyal user base. On the tablet side, Samsung is preparing a strong lineup as well. The Galaxy Tab S11 series could come pre-loaded with One UI.0, while the Tab S10, S9, and S8 series are expected to be eligible. Samsung's tablet ecosystem has matured significantly, and a major software upgrade will enhance productivity, entertainment, and multitasking experiences even further. Budget-focused lineups like the Galaxy M and F series will get more limited support. Models launched in 2024 and 2025 that qualify under the four-year update policy are likely candidates. Not every device will make the cut, but newer models have a strong chance. One UI 9.0 is expected to be more than a small refresh. Performance improvements, better battery efficiency, stronger security, updated animations, and deeper personalization tools are all part of the package. AI features are likely to expand dramatically, including smarter camera features, better notification management, and improved cross-device connectivity. A simple rule helps predict eligibility. Devices that receive One UI 8.0 and One UI 8.5 will most likely qualify for One UI 9 Kono. This includes the Galaxy S23 lineup, the Z Fold and Z Flip 5, and devices launched afterward. Anyone using a recent Samsung flagship or premium mid-range device should feel confident about getting the upcoming upgrade. Before One UI 9.0 arrives, One UI 8.5 is first based on Android 16. This update will likely debut with the Galaxy S26 series in early 2026. Samsung has moved toward a consistent release cycle, which means leaks, beta programs, and feature previews will surface months ahead of the official rollout. While all the software hype continues, Samsung has also made headlines with a surprising Black Friday deal on the Galaxy S25 Ultra. The 520GB model is receiving a massive 39% discount with a 400 price drop. The regular price of Lelto 99 falls to 899 with no trade-in required, giving users access to a top-level flagship at an unexpectedly low price. What makes this deal even more interesting is a glitch being reported by some users. In certain cases, the price drops further to 1859 for the same 5120GB model. The discount triggers automatically but appears inconsistently. Some users claim that clicking the purchase link multiple times causes the glitch price to appear. The process is simple. Choose the S25 Ultra, select no trade, in and check if the price adjusts. It depends on timing and a bit of luck, but catching it means major savings. Deals like this do not last long, and stock tends to disappear quickly. It is uncommon to see a cutting edge flagship price below 900, let alone lower due to a glitch. That wraps up all the major news for now. More information about One UI Point Joe, eligible devices and future Samsung updates will surface soon. New leaks, early beta builds, and official announcements will gradually confirm everything currently rumored. Staying informed is the best way to keep up with Samsung's growing ecosystem, evolving technology, and yearly software advancements.